All right, guys, welcome back to Stuck on an Island, where I'm stuck with you, but we are always smiling. So, like, um, I told you guys that I was about to, to get some work done and whatever. Can you imagine I was here waiting for my client and stuff, and, like, they didn't show up, so... Here I am. So, I'm pretty much just writing some reports really quick. I have one more hour, and then, um, Judo was like, you're not coming for dinner? Well, she didn't say it like that, because she sent it in a text, but I'm just impersonating my baby. Something that's what she said, but yeah. So I'm gonna go over there for dinner, even though contrary to what I said, I said I wasn't. But yeah, I would have gone normally and not pick up the camera. But I'm like, you know what? I know some of you really appreciate the vlogs, cause trust me, we're growing, and some people are like, yo, where are the vlogs? I see you, so I, you didn't put out a video. So I'm gonna pick up the video, pick up the camera, and just go over there, take a few clips. This video, this, this vlog might not be so long. But it's gonna be like one of those filler vlogs where because the majority of the vlogs that I really want to put out really is just the travel vlogs definitely But of course, you know to show you guys like, you know the background of like a day in the life of me because like a lot of persons like crazily I don't know people people sometimes used to wonder like, you know, like oh my gosh You take you know, you're always on an adventure when really and truly I'm not always on an adventure Of course, I live a regular life. I have to do work and stuff But those who, who always keep wondering. Oh, what is it? Whatever like what do you do? I'm gonna say this again if you didn't hear the Q&A, whatever, is in me. I'm an online consultant. In a shorter version, you would just say a teacher or a lecturer or whatever. Like, I work with um, business people and I pretty much teach them pretty much. So, that's what I, um, that's my job. So, it allows me the flexibility at the moment. Yo, give God thanks that I was blessed with it. Give me the flexibility to, you know, work on my own time most times is in me. So, that's why I can take the adventure vlogs every now and again. But, yeah. So I'm gonna go over there because like right now guys I'm hungry and in the last vlog you guys saw that I ate only banana chips and the gizada so I can't wait to be at your house Judah guys can you believe like I came home for the two hours of work and no one showed up none of my clients showed up so pretty much I wasted some time so anyway I'm gonna show you something that I already did show you but I didn't really you know take you to another location which is Devon House I remember I went to Devon House once and the security guy was like you can't use your camera well he was nice about it but you know I didn't really get much footage but I'm gonna take you guys to another Devon House location because what's nice about Devon House is you have a traditional location in Kingston where everyone goes and they you know the young couples sit around and they eat ice cream but we do have like other locations all around in the island small shops and I love this company reason being they they produce quality product I think it's the best locally produced ice cream company that there is and it's been around as long as I can remember as a child so big up Devon House so what I'm gonna do because I told you before in the other vlog like you know I don't want to go over to Judah's house you know like too often every Sunday which I know our, per our parents won't have a problem with it but I'm gonna go there because I think it's you know people are cooking for you and stuff and even though sometimes I try to I help out in the kitchen and stuff you know I think it's nice to you know bring some ice cream so I'm gonna buy some ice cream she says they want like rum and rate no oh my god did I forget you know you might have said it go to the shop and forget everything in list. oh crunchy munchy and um Devon Stout. If you guys are not from Jamaica or you've never been to Jamaica, try out the Devon Stout ice cream. Bomb, bro. It's really good. So I'm gonna do that. But I have to go pick up my sister from church, take her back home, and then Judah and I will pick up some ice cream. Guys, and I'm wearing my favorite shirt. Well, one of my favorite shirts. This is my favorite team, Manchester United. So if any of y'all are ever thinking of buying me a gift, somebody ears out the ring. <laughs> I love Manchester United. This is like the 2000. 2016 to 17 jersey i would really love to have the newer one 2017 to 18 or whenever it is probably my next birthday i'd like one of these jerseys so yeah big thing i love manchester united glory glory man united all of the arsenal for them and chelsea for them city for them who get back so i go miss sorry switch to our next vlog wow guys sometimes you gotta stop and look at these stuff man these stuff are free and they're nice but anyway I'm gonna kind of show you. 
Oh, Kapo, get off me, man. You guys won't be able to see, but any of you who are like predominantly Jamaican, you guys remember when they came around with a fogging machine to get the mosquitoes and stuff? John Owen, that shit smells stink too. Stay seated. Sit, Mocha. <laughs> That's what they say, you wild. Kapo, sit down. Sit. 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 This one definitely isn't trained. But like, <laughs> stop. Sit. Moka. Mokachino. Sit. Good. See? So like for all those people who are like really interested with dogs and stuff, it's really hard to train three dogs at once. Definitely it's really a difficult task to do that. Because you realize two of them, they understand me, but the other small one, she, I haven't really trained her as yet. So I have to definitely do that because when those two are calm and one is acting all agitated, then it's a problem. But then the funny thing is they're puppies and they're full of energy, so it's really hard to whatever. And like these kind of dogs, they aim to please. Like they want to please you, especially if you're a good master. So I'm at the balance stage right now and he he's an attention seeker. You guys can see that. He's a really attention seeker, even though he likes to come up for hugs, which is not really good because I don't want him doing that to my friends and making everybody feel uncomfortable. But I'm gonna take some time out, guys, for those of you who think that, you know, and take some time out with them. Don't move. Sit. Mocha. Sit. So you see, I just went in the, the room just now and I came back out and she's still sitting down. Like I do have to start, I think when I get to like six months and they start calming down just a little bit more, I'm going to start working with them more individually. Because these two are workable, but the other little small one, Latte, you know, she, I've never really took her for a walk or try to talk to her much, so she's not as, sit, Capo, sit, sit down. Good boy. Like Kapo, I've worked with, I've taken him for walks and I've talked with him, you know, teach him how to do hug, sit down, and he learns it really quick. Mocha, she learned how to sit because when I told Kapo to sit, she learns from that. But like Latte, she's different. Her personality wise is different. But I have to start, you know, getting more discipline, especially when it comes down to like certain things like that. So big up a subscribe, but I did mention it, even though my dog didn't know why. I'm messing with you. <laughs> But like, yeah, I have to do that um, because when they get bigger, these dogs are going to get really huge. Well, I'm hoping that they do and they have to be in control. I'm used to I'm used to things like this because I used to have five German Shepherds anyway and like they are obedient. But like I never taught them like sit down, stay, walk. They just understood when I say, yo, get around the back or chill. They understood just stuff like that. Just, just stuff like that freaky shit, man. Guys, but just come pick up my sister and Judah. I'm just wait upon them. And who nervous like me? Yo, me hates when my gas tank they don't get seen. But like right now, the gas in the Portmore is cheaper than in a Kingston, so I think we can hold out. You guys, we just we just got to Devon House. Yo. She just found out. Hey guys, <laughs> follow me on Instagram. <laughs> what is your Instagram tag? Oh, yeah. uh, she don't know. It's at, at, at underscore Shanti and follow Lasagna Lovers J. You do that? Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay, that Lasagna Lovers. Maybe we we'll go probably chat out one night because they have a little thing that they do. Babe, is it enough for everybody? That one? Is it enough for everybody? Why are you tripping? <laughs> Guys, I'm wondering if you're not cool. Judah found a scrappy. I think you look like scrappy guys from the little cute pop or all of these accurate. You like to go fishing on SpongeBob or Arthur? You're tripping. Sorry. So we're getting a quarter ice cream. Yeah. That's it. Cost $1,450. Huh? Yeah. And it's 
really good. I'm gonna show you all the ice cream. Immediately I feel like a kid again. And I want a snow can. All these nice flavors. What's your favorite flavor, babe? Cookies and cream. Cookies and cream? You know you're not getting that in the bucket today. Yes, I am. No, you're not. I no, I told you Devon Stout and Country Munchy. Because I'm not, I don't want to taste cooking and cream. I'm, I'm... See that? See that? Look at this thing over here. So even if it's a new time, it's okay. You get what you want when you're popping. It's a popcorn. Judah is a popcorn. I stayed at the bar when I never pop. That's Judah. Still go ahead and order the damn cookie and cream. Because you have to take care of your baby. No comment? You talk to them? No comment. You have a thing for the table. Just want to see that man over there so I need my ice cream. Right? No, it's the guy in the blue. Not the green. Well, I like what he's doing over there. <laughs> Guys, free sample, go take a Judah. People take a Judah, free sample. It's nice. Oh god. Guys, the ice cream is so rich. I swear, I mean, even meet the call when I make them ice cream. So, the ice cream is big and rich. I know that crazy thing, though. Nothing beats hugging us, though. I'm sorry. Shut up, boy. Guys, it's a hug, make us. So big, never know. Know that. Because I think with Jamaican people in the guys, they pick up other brands. You see me with people even even know that's, them. That's, that's not it. That's not it. My favorite flavor of ice cream is. Show our gear point of view. Tell us what oh, your hug and that. My favorite flavor is um, a caramel, a caramel oh, sauce. Vanilla caramel brownie from Hagen's. Like that's. Yeah, but I start comparing the quality of the, 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 the cream and the churn. It, it's still, huh? it, it's still a nice and just like this. But this flavor is like really nice though. Because you like hugging those guys. But me have to do. You see, the thing is, by the, the roots guy in the relationship. If I suppose to pick an ice cream Babe, can I get from your mango? No, I'm buying Devon Nose now. Babe, can I get hugging those? Look at that hugging those and get it now. Huh? Yeah, but that's the thing. What we to the supermarket? Suppose that supermarket don't sell it in the shop. Like don't have the flavor we want in the shop. Excuse me. No, I'm not saying because I have to really search for that flavor. Like search. Because normally when you go to the supermarket, you can find like you know like vanilla or Roman raisin, like the plain thing. But yeah, that's enough of our ice cream talk. Her ears take like caramel. See that? Full, that's it. Yeah, looks good. All right, guys. So I pretty much just got to Judah's house right now. Um, I'll go try so I can get to write some reports. I, I brought my laptop with me, and I just got a bowl of cereal. Cause I thought dinner would have been halfway through, but nah, it's not. We're gonna be making some dinner. Well, Judah's making some dinner. I guess it's some pretty easy stuff, and I'm having some honey nut Cheerios. Guys, Judah internet of the yard. I plug. 23 minutes. Upload this video. Unfortunately, in my house, I have flow, and a video like this would literally take me three to four hours, and this is taking like 22 minutes. Bruh. But um, this is Digicel's internet. Um, I tried to get it in my house, in my area. They tried one time, but like some internet boxes in there, blah, 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 long story. So like I'm off to wait for a long time, but if I had this internet here, man, like I'll be uploading videos like a lot faster. So I think what I'll do is like some Sundays, I'll just come over here, just 
upload some videos like real quick because this internet is fast. Wow well, guys, the video pretty much done upload already. It's just processing. It's already uploaded, it's just processing. Three minutes left. Bro. Anyway, here about to munch on some beef soup, some leftover beef soup that Judah's mom made. Yup. So, just done get some food a while ago. I'm sure the food look. Oh, oh. Crime scene. It's not that again. Right? No. <laughs> <laughs> <It doesn't. laughs> I got some lemonades freshly squeezed from grandma's tree. Grandma's not here. <laughs> oh my god, kids. This is the one is here. I'm drinking her little lemonade. Say hi to the vlog. Say hi, Mika. Say hi, Miko. Hi, Mika. Mika. <laughs> hi, say hi, sis. <laughs> She's watching you, you know. Yeah, she, she wants to hear. So tell her, say hi, sis. Where are you going, Shay? Well, Mika, she said it telepathically. Hi, Mika. <laughs> okay. no. Yes? No. Yes? No! But I love you. Okay. But I love you. It's no. Judah. But I love you. What do you mean, it's Judah? What do I do? Minutes before dinner. Uh, uh, you make it? Uh, no! Cover up, baby. No! Guys, I am pretty beat right now. Like, I'm about to go get some ice cream and sit down for a little bit and chill with Judah. Scratching my balls. Bye. <laughs> guys, remember these three. I can't even do the three things with his hands because it's my it's my balls hands. I got you, babe. Remember these three things: love, nature, and adaptation. And remember to keep the link. Oh, I hate